Hello and good evening. I'm Adam Shapiro. And I'm David Bondi. For our top stories tonight, the E. coli virus from Taco Bell has scared a lot of people in Elizabeth. So now we go to Shai Kinnap, who's on the scene. Thank you, Adam. I'm here on the streets of Little Moore in Elizabeth, New Jersey, where the entire scare of E. coli has rattled the nation. We're going to take a quick look at Dunkin' Donuts, where uh, suspicion of the E. coli virus has spread. Let's go take a look. Uh, can I interview you for a second? Yeah, sure, go ahead. Oh, you know about the entire E. coli scare at Taco Bell and everything? Mm -hmm. I was wondering, do you have any E. coli in the store? No, he doesn't work here anymore. E. coli doesn't work here anymore? No. Um, I, I don't know if it's a person. I, th I think it's in the food. Oh, yeah, yeah, we have E. coli in the buttermilk cream, jelly, the strawberry, and the vanilla cream. You do have E. coli? Yes, we do. There you have it, guys. The E. coli scare not only at Taco Bell, but at Dunkin' Donuts as well. Unfortunate. Um, by the way, um, do you have... Is this free? Yeah, that's right. Strong? Yeah. I'm sure? Yeah. Have a nice day. Take care. Thank you, Shy. And coming up next, how the fire drill could actually save you from class. Yeah, so like, first we hit up the library. Ooh, we! We take everything. Reference books, fiction, you name it, we has it. It was like taking baby from a candy. Yeah, plus we got enough coffee for the next six trimesters. <laughs> Boy, will Rabbi Abel be happy. No doubt about it. We should do this again sometime. And it was all for free. Yeah, free. City Identity Theft Solutions. Free with any city card. Help getting your life back? That's using your card. Yeah. 